Um, is completely flat out. Bless her. You excited for Costco? Yeah. Always. Why are you Help. Oh my god, he can't even stop. Cool. I'm just excited. <laughs> I'm just excited. <laughs> This looks so cool. I mean, this is 50 quid, but think how much fun you're having this. I mean, I, I'm not a bullshit here. She'd love this. She would like that. I mean, look at that slab there. How big is this, though? Daddy? Yeah. Do you want this, Sam? Three metres by two metres, so it's a decent size. But Will it take up the whole of the grass? Um, no. I mean, she's the woman, but it's still, it's relatively big. I've she's the things. woman. Oh, I've got the slide, though. Do you want to look at this? I think this looks amazing for She'd her. love it. Should we put it in as a maybe? Should, yeah, because there might be other things around I mean, there. This is 46 quid. Let's, let's leave it here. Why? Yeah. No, what? Just put one in. Okay. Okay. It's Come going on. in, Am. Um. I think Wendy, yeah. Looks nice though. I like it. So we've got one of these in our basket. Brilliant. But, oh my god, I really like these. These are like those um like porcelain ones, Jack, with the lid on. When you like save your dinner. I really like these. They're microwavable as well. I think these are really good. Oh. Like little, um... No, you, you can't really use them. Yeah, and regards to the fact that I'll Let's bash all my ideas down. Yeah. Hand sanitizer. Costco is the place to come. Oh my God, look at this one. It's massive. Yeah, I know. It's got a pump. A pump for ease. Just like them as chairs. I don't want a bar stool. Yeah, if they were like short, they'd be perfect, really. I know. I can still play extra time. Oh, Jack. What are you doing? You don't need to see it. What is the mate? Yeah, that one, it's annoying. The naughty aisle. Belgian thins. <gasps> you know that? Imagine having a pack of them. No. Oh my god. Now that is something Anne would want in the cupboard, isn't it? I know. No, I want these. I mean, yeah, they're nice. It's just, they get so expensive because they're like... Are they Reese Thins? Just thinner things. Thinner cups? Yeah. Oh, I feel like we need a treat of something, Jack. Like, what about this giant dairy milk bar? What about that? Giant dairy milk bar. Yeah. Not a pure dairy milk. I've sweets. You haven't. Yeah. I don't really want to have in my it's sweets. Not fun, they've got a lot more um, they did, they gym did, kind of stuff now, haven't they? They've got loads. Of stuff. Yeah. Like, Creatine. This my class but it all depends really what people are interested. What's class free workouts? So that is good. I've had that before. Oh, that's not bad. Icy blue raspberry. Yeah, that's the flavour. I think I remember you having that. It's like that really blue one. They are, they're always like that. But well, say you get two there for that price. Yeah, it's really pack. good. good 37 each. Yeah. Decent. And these, Jack? Yeah, they're nice. What, darling? 
Oh no. Oh, <gasps> no. What are you saying? Oh no to? Oh no. Oh no. The food is actually open there, but I think it's just for hot dogs. Oh is it? Yeah. I mean I'm gonna get a hot dog because I'm just having <laughs> them, which we love. There's so many crisps. Sweet curry, Jack. No, we prefer sweet curry. Sweet chilli. You don't even like sweet chilli. I like sweet chilli. Oh my god, what about these? Bourbon barbecue. Quinoa chips. They're absolutely massive. Like, you wouldn't even get through it, would you? Lentil chips. Himalayan pink salt. Oh my god. They'd be so nice. And they're just Himalayan salt, but they're normal crisps. Oh my god. Or you can just get a big box of walkers. Oh, that's quite good. That is quite good for Am. For Am. Quavers, what's it's Am Monster Munch, 24 of each. Oh my god. Oh. Didn't actually say how long it lasts for a lot. Storage keep refrigerated. Mm. A bit different in this sort of tub though, isn't it? Yeah, because you can I mean, I'd be lock for, it. I'd be eating that for a month. <laughs> it's a I don't think you would. There's not that much in it. No, I wouldn't. No, you wouldn't. Even more hummus. I don't know. Four days since day. Oh, no. You wouldn't eat that in four days. Well, you probably would, but... Because you'd have it like five times a day. I'd have to have it over a meal, just because I know I'm on, I'm on a time. I lost you. What is that? I mean, we're not getting it. It's, like a, it's something you put in a pool. Oh, look at her. Off you go. Come on. Oh no! What else have we got down here? Oh! A Pat Man machine! For 335 pounds. No thank you. To hear you that loud am. Washing machines and longer with Calcon. You can't help but say it, can you, when you see it? They're a three pack though. I think you'd like them. Chicken wrapped. Oh, Vegetable inside, chicken wrapped. Don't put it on the floor though. Is it? It's not rawhide though, is it? Oh, wow, it's oh big, isn't it? Is that from here though? I've not seen that one before, have you? They're the same mate. Monty's living life. To be fair, these fit perfect. So you're going to get them? Yeah, alright. So. Beef superfood, beef, super beef burger with quinoa flavoured with red beet and kelp. Or do we get chicken treats with sweet potato, carrot and pumpkin or chicken treats with spinach and kale? I think the chicken and pumpkin one because that I, I feel like I would eat that. Okay. I mean I'm not going to but... Because they fit in his ball you put them in his ball. <laughs> mm -hmm. oh, it's alright. Oh my god. I'm so tired! They're literally the best noodles ever. They take three minutes in the microwave. Um, Jack is in the queue in Costco and he's queuing up to get some food. I've bought some like these frozen noodle things so I think I'm gonna have them when I get back. Yeah, it weren't too bad, you know, like it, everybody kind of kept their distance. It's a huge shop anyway, so you can't really not keep your distance in Costco. It's massive. So yeah, I've got some really good bits. I'm gonna do a bit of a haul when I get back um, and show you what we got. I've got some really good stuff, really happy with it. Um, yeah, so we'll show you when we get back. What I managed to get. Um, looks like Jack's on his way back to the car now. We also got fuel here as well because it's a really good price. So I'll see you when we get back. So we've just got back from Costco and I thought I was gonna go through everything that we got um and i've also got the receipt so i can what's up baby yeah we'll get that down in a minute i've also got the receipt so we can go through exactly how much things cost 
So we did end up buying this playground adventure and I think, I believe it was £46 with VAT. Um, it's just going to be really good for the weekends and she can play about and something for her to do, basically. So normally every time we go to Costco, I end up buying these and they're literally just noodles with vegetables and they're really, really nice, really convenient. They take three minutes in the microwave and they taste really, really good. I don't really know what the dressing is. It just says a savory sauce, but they are really, really good and super easy. And Emily hasn't had these yet, but I think she will she will like them they're really good just if you need like a random snack throughout the day but you don't want to like make loads of food just shove them in the microwave for three minutes and voila got itself a nice little meal the noodles were actually on offer this week and they were six pound but they're normally like nearly eight pound but you do get six in there so it's quite cost effective random buy but obviously we needed some milk and they just got them in there so that was 170 for two of those and then we got these dog treats for the dog he loves these and they fit really well in his like treat ball so if you have dogs that have like the round balls with the hole in and you put the treat in these are really good they fit absolutely perfectly and he loves them and they last ages these finish dishwasher tablets i went for these because i follow a youtuber lucy carter and she recommended these because they're no like you don't need to rinse before you use them so i thought i'd give them a go and you get how many here 140 for 17 pound which i think is pretty good so we also got this uh, pack of water which you get 40 in there and that's two pound 69 which is just mad I don't even know how they can sell it for that but we like to keep this in the gym because then you can literally just grab a drink whenever you want so they got these bin liners they are five pound 49 and they're really good they're really strong and you get a hundred and we buy them literally a couple of times a year so they're really great we also got some eggs today we've never had the eggs from there but because we needed some we just picked some up and you get 24 medium um, they are free range and I wouldn't buy anything else as Jack knows and they were £2.75 like insane the kitchen roll we always get this kitchen roll it's really good it's really thick and you literally need like one sheet to do anything with which I absolutely love um, whilst we've obviously been in lockdown I've been having to buy it from asda and bnm and the asda one was quite good but the bnm one was shocking it was not good at all didn't rate that so obviously because we wanted to do a bit of an essentials trip we picked up the kitchen roll and you get 12 rolls in there for 12 pound which it's a pound a roll so that is really really cost effective and then we have only just recently started buying pampers for amelie we're using the aldi nappiers but and I can't say that they're not good because they were really good when we first started using them. Um, the Aldi nappies are really good and they were really good when we started using them. But as she's got older, I just feel that they weren't really holding enough in, especially at night time. Um, we were waking up every morning to a wet bed and to be quite honest, it was doing my head in and I couldn't cope with it anymore. So Jack went to the shop and he bought a pack of Pampers just to try them. And they have been really, really good. Like, I can't, I can't complain at all. So, they had, obviously, when you go and get them from the shops, I think you get, like, 30 for, like, £8. Which is quite expensive when you compare them to the Audi ones, where you get, like, 30 for, like, £2 something. Which is just crazy. So, we managed to get 92 and they were £15. So... It's not bad, not bad at all really. Um, we'll, they'll last us quite a while, so I'm really happy with those. Another thing that I picked up was these DKNY seamless bralettes. The reason I picked these up is when I was pregnant with Amelie, I bought these from Costco, the exact same ones, black and white, and they were really, really good. Still to the point that I wear them now because they're so comfortable, I absolutely love them. 
but I bought them in large because obviously I was larger when I was pregnant with Amelie. So, so yeah, I've bought them again and I've bought them in a size medium. So I'm really hoping that they fit a bit better than the large ones that I've got at the moment. So I really hope that you enjoyed our Costco haul. Um, we definitely got some really good essential pieces today and that was the only reason that we were going to Costco. Obviously it's nice to have a look around and see what they've got but we wanted to get some really like essential bits and pieces that we've been getting to the end of. Really happy with what we managed to get today. There was definitely a lot of other stuff that I could have ended up picking up that I pulled myself back and didn't. Um, I've really wanted some like cakes and stuff like that, but I had to tell myself, no, you don't need any cakey bits or anything like that. I'm really trying to be good at the moment. So yeah, no, couldn't get any cake. <laughs> Obviously the prices, when you say Costco prices, like sound big. 15 pounds for a pack of nappies it sounds big but when you think you get 92 in a pack it's just you're buying it now instead of obviously continually going to the shop and dribs and drabs like here and there and so if you did look at it you would save money over the course of buying a couple of packets you would save money by buying them in bulk first and we do like to do that quite a bit because one, it saves you from going to the shop all the time. And two, it's just nice to just get it out. It's just out the way then. It's just done and dusted. And you've got a load of things. Our house at the moment, even though it is a kind of reasonable size, one of the reasons why we don't really want to stay here is because of the lack of storage. There's just nothing. There's nowhere to put like those 40 water bottles. Like Jack would probably buy about 10 packs if we went, if we had the space, but we don't have the space at the moment. Um, we did have the space when we had the garage, but obviously he's turned it into a gym, so we don't really have that space anymore. So that is a bit annoying, and that is definitely one reason why we want to get out of this house. We love our house so much, and it's so nice, but it just isn't offering us what we need as a family. We just need more space, like more space. So yeah, like I said, I really hope you enjoyed this haul. Let me know if you want to see some more haul. We've got a pretty little thing haul coming up and that is just like little bits of casual wear and things like that that I thought would be nice to show you. Take care everybody, stay safe and I'll see you again soon.